Hey guys, Josh here from Think Fit. Today's video is about environment and how important it is to your success. So I hear so many people say that um, they struggle struggle with self-discipline, you know, willpower is a lacking thing for them and it's shocking how, how easily they are taken off course from what they're trying to do, whether it's food, moving forward in their life, business, whatever. So one thing we really need to concentrate on is our environment. Are you setting yourself up for success? I know for me um, personally, if you come up to where I live in the fridge, it's just all meal prep stuff. I have fruit there, boring as shit if anyone visits, but you know what, we can go out and grab food. Um, the thing is, I do not have shit food within arm's reach. Like if I'm up here doing work, it's, it's so much easier for me just to grab some nuts, whatever else, but they're all healthy options. I'm making sure that my environment is setting me up for success. Same as like leaving water on the desk. I make sure I have water there so that I actually drink my two, li two liters a day. Otherwise you get so focused, you just forget. But if you see something in reach and it's like a trigger for you, you will then take it, drink it, eat it, whatever. So guys, you need to think about what's in your environment, what's holding you back, what do you constantly end up reaching for that is screwing you over? If it's a TV, how about you pull the TV out of the wall every time you finish using it so there's that little bit of tension and having to plug it in and go and um, to use it. You know, if it's your Netflix account, how about you log out every time or something like, you just gotta take that next step to make sure you're setting yourself up for success. Okay, this includes going to certain places if you know that you're absolutely hopeless, you should avoid them until you get your goals, you know, until you get what you want. Um, it's, it's super important to make sure that you're taking care of you. I also hear parents say, oh, I have to keep this in the house for my kids. You know what? Yeah, kids should be able to eat whatever, but if you're trying to be healthy, you should be trying to instill that into your kids as well. If they're not eating healthy, it's only going to cause you more dramas in the future. You keep your kids healthy, you keep them fit, you keep them, um, their education, their everything else is going to improve because of this. So just because they do want it, it's your chance to influence better behavior. You know, everyone wants the best for their kids, yet they feed them shit food. I, it's, it's, I get it. Every now and then, it's cool. But if your house is like filled with it, you end up with some chubby kids. Like my mom didn't have that much stuff around, but you think things are healthy, but packaged food, guys, we need to really reduce the amount we're having, okay? Um, the healthier they are, the happier they are, the more confident they are, the better they feel about themselves. So make sure you're giving them every opportunity to be the best kids alive, um, and that's just gonna flourish throughout their life. All right, so set yourself up for success, make sure the environment, anything in arm's reach is helping you move forward, and yeah, let me know how you go with that, or just think about it, let me know what you're throwing out maybe, you know? Change your environment and change your life.